Hey friends, it's Angie, and today I'd like to share with you a Dollar Tree haul, or should I say a few Dollar Tree hauls. Um, this is some things that I have collected from several different times that I went into one of my favorite stores, Dollar Tree, and Dollar Tree is really stepping up the game. I've said this before, they are just putting out some amazing products, so if you have a Dollar Tree, definitely go check them out, and um, you'll be so surprised at everything that you can find there for less than you'd pay at other stores. So let's get into this. This may have to be two parts. I'm not sure. Um, I'm kind of at a different angle today because I'm trying to keep the fan and the light out as much as I can because I know that's annoying. But um, yeah, let's get into this. Like I said, this is going to be kind of a combination of several different times that I've went to Dollar Tree. First things I'm going to show you are from my most recent Dollar Tree shop that I went uh, on and I went on Monday. And this Dollar Tree that I go to is one of the Dollar Trees that I absolutely love. It's always nice and clean. Things are stocked. You can usually find about anything you're looking for there. And so I really like to frequent that one the most. And the first thing I wanna show you is these beautiful cups. I had seen people hauling these on YouTube and TikTok. And so I went hoping to find them and I did. I got this kind of a coral or peach colored one. And the lids are kind of silicone, so they just kind of snap on. And then the straws are like the ones you get in like your tumblers. So very nice little, for me, like iced coffee is probably what I'll use it for. But you could use it for anything. And they've got kind of like an iridescent look to them. $1.25, you can't beat it. So I got the purple one as well. And I didn't notice, but the purple one has a coral straw in it so I don't know if someone switched it out or maybe one got lost or if that's the way it came I didn't pay attention enough to know but it doesn't matter I have plenty of other straws here if I wanted to change it out and then I got the kind of a mint green or aqua colored one this one's really pretty so definitely check out your Dollar Tree they have some other nice uh, cups and tumblers and just all kinds of fun spring summery type uh things for your drinks so a few boring things here i got some of these face masks just for cleaning around here at my house i didn't have any from before and when i dust dust really uh gets to my allergies and i'll get like stuffy and stuff for days so um i got some of these to wear while i'm dusting Another boring item, just some toilet bowl cleaner. This is the one that I like to use the most, the works. Um, and this is the cheapest place, I guess, so far that I found it. A lot of stores don't even carry it anymore. Um, we have well water and our well water has a lot of iron in it. So um, things get orangey and this really helps to get that off. So pick that up, I was out. I picked up some catnip. They had some little packages of catnip. I picked up, I want to open this because I want to show y'all what it actually looks like, but the packaging is going to be torn out, but I had gotten another one of these, which I'll show you here in a minute from a, another haul, but these are the um, LA Colors Peach Sherbet Scented Lip Balm, and I tore the package up, sorry about that. They have Peach peach Sherbet, sherb is it Sherbet? Yeah. Peach Sherbet, they have a watermelon one, I think they have a blue raspberry, and there might be another one. But I had picked up the, let me show you. This is what it looks like before you open it. I picked up the watermelon one and decided I wanted a peach one as well. Because I do love peach. So each one of them looks like it's an animal. I think this one's a bird. It's yellow. And it just twists open like those EOS type lip balms. So uh, Dollar Tree has been kind of duping those a lot lately. Smells really nice. Smells very creamy and peach. So I'm just going to go on and open this one too, but this was not from this same haul. I got this one a week or two ago, and it is just says it's watermelon, and it's a little kitty. Super cute. And then again, it just twists off, and it's pink. So if you see those at your store and you like lip balms, I'm a lip balm junkie myself, so um, I always pick up the lip balms, and now I'm throwing trash on the floor, so oh well. Also from this haul, I picked up some of the uh, 
Tinted Lip Balm. It says, go from clear to your unique lip color. Color changing. This is from Be Pure. I opened this already. Because I had started a video yesterday and then my husband showed up so I didn't get to finish. So I decided just to start over. So it's got the little flower inside. It's clear. Um, but look at this packaging. The tube is so beautiful with the gold. And then when you make it come out there's the flower isn't that beautiful beautiful gift for mother's day or any occasion really gift baskets so i'm gonna put this on because i don't have anything on my lips right now it's kind of dark in here because it is cloudy we're getting like three days of rain i don't know why i had the shades because i haven't had coffee today see how it turns out I guess I see a little bit of a difference so that is the be pure tinted lip balm and then what else did I get during this oh yeah it's all down here in the floor that's why wait is it this bag not this bag but these bags so let's dive in and see what else we got here I got me a a pill cutter because um with my vitamin c a lot of times I've been taking it lately and it just chokes me to try to uh, take it. So I'm gonna cut it in half, pick that up while I was there. These are so cute. I don't remember if they had these last year in the Shore Living line. They are LED coastal pillar candles with a flickering effect. I'm gonna take the label off so you can see the actual design that they have on them. Cause there was two different design, designed ones at this store. And this one has turtles with like your, uh, not algae, but like your seaweed and all of that. So this one has two turtles, one on each like round with bubbles. And I don't know if it has batteries in it already, probably not, or it's already been used. So I'll have to, oh wait, no, it's got a little thing on the bottom you pull out. Oh, that's beautiful, I love it. I like that a lot. Not sure where I'll put it, but I couldn't pass them up. I thought they were gorgeous. So I got that one. And then I found this one too that is also different. And again, this is from that shore living line that they do. It's just like a beachy kind of line, which I love beach stuff. My house, my house is beach themed. So um, most of my rooms are beach themed. So uh, there's a few that aren't, but like my bedroom, my bathrooms, and my living room and my kitchen kind of are. So I picked up this one. This one's got uh, like a starfish and some different shells. So that's really pretty. These will be beautiful in a bathroom too, just to give you a little bit of light in there. So you just pull the little plastic thing out and they're ready to go. That's beautiful, I love it. I like how it flickers. Hopefully that doesn't make anyone sick. So I got those and this is the main reason why I went was to see if they did have this line out yet. Look at this. This is new, I think, for this year. It is like a little note in a bottle, the little seashell in there tied around uh, like with twine. This is so pretty. I wish I could have found it in other colors, but this one's kind of either a purple or a dark blue, and this is the only one my store had of this. All right. My friend Melanie had hauled one of these, so I was hoping to find them. I found this one in Beach. I almost got some more, but some of them were not very good at the way that they had the wording. You couldn't really read it. They had Beach, Love, Home, and Relax. And I really wanted the Relax one, but you couldn't read it the way they did the twine or this rope. I didn't care for it a lot. Um, so I'll look at other ones and see. Maybe I can find it there that I like better. If not, I'm okay with just the Beach one. You can hang these. They have hangers or you can just set them up, which I'll probably just set mine up. So there was that. I got some of these little uh, shore living pins, little starfish. I think what I might do with these, I haven't made up my mind yet, um, is put them outside. I have the little garden flag at the end so that the garden flag doesn't move. I don't know if this is gonna be strong enough so um, I may have to come up with another plan, but if not, I'll figure out something I can use these for. They're too cute. Oh my gosh, you guys, look at these seahorses. 
This looks like something you would get at like Hobby Lobby or some somewhere like that. Definitely more expensive than $1.25. So I picked up two of these. I don't think I've seen these at Dollar Trees before. So this might be another new item. Now, one thing I noticed is this was not over with the Shore Living line. These were over with like the craft section. They were just kind of thrown there. So I found them there and picked them up. So maybe they're not actually the Shore Living line and that's why. Yeah, it just says Resin Seahorse. But I'm glad I found them because it goes with my beach theme and I love it. Picked up two of them. Because I'm telling you, if you don't pick things up at Dollar Tree when you go, it may not be there when you go back. That's just the way it is there. I got a couple of these signs that are like three different things hanging on this twine. It's got relax, a sand dollar, and what does that say? Unwind. I can't even read it backwards. So this might be nice to put in a bedroom or a bathroom since it does say relax and unwind. If I can get it back together without breaking it. And then I got this one that says just the same kind of sign. It's got a mermaid here, like a little uh, silver or chrome mermaid. And it says, this is our happy place. Love this one. This one's super cute. Ah, gonna break them. Got those. And then I looked at these. These were when I first got in the door. They're like a little jar or vase and they've got a little bit of like a uh, twine here and some seagrass or something like that and a shell but I couldn't figure out what I would use them for. So I didn't pick up one at first. I'm gonna show you here in just a minute why I went back and got it. These are really pretty and they had different colors and they had different styles too. They had these little short ones, they had uh, taller ones. And then I picked up these little wall charms. This one's in a seashell, the little rope on the bottom. So you could hang them or you could like Take them apart and use them for anything that you would want, I guess. I'll probably hang them. I got some of these. I think these will be great to put around like your wax warmers or your candles or any kind of decoration. We've got a sand dollar with the beads and the rope on the end. And then I got the shell one. I think this is supposed to be a conch shell. Now it does say wall decor on this one, but I don't know how you would hang that in my opinion so I'll just use it around my candles and uh, wax warmers that's what I usually do with them all right so that is everything for that bag put it all back in here because I'm going to use all this for decoration but I'm not going to get to it today because the hubs will be home here in a little bit ready to eat well if I don't break anything we'll be doing really good here I'm trying to get it back in here without breaking it so that's all I'm gonna put in there. I think some of the breakable stuff I'm gonna leave out. Okay, so for that little vase, I was over by the like artificial flowers and I found these. I don't know if Dollar Tree has had these before. Sorry, I've gotta get a drink. Getting dry back here. These are called a coastal pick. They are from the Shore Living. Melanie, I don't know if you found these. I can't remember, but if you can find these, I can see you doing a lot of things with these little coastal picks. So I picked these up, different ones, to stick down in this little vase. Now I may have to cut them a little bit to make them a little bit shorter, but I think that is gonna be so cute. So I picked up that one. They have these with the little shells. Picked up two of that kind. Now some of them are a little bit shorter than the others. And I may have to get a little foam insert. I'm just gonna have to work with it. I'm not very crafty, so. But I loved them so much, I wanted to have them to display in my home. And when I saw them, I'm like, I'm gonna go back and get one of those vases and I'm gonna make it work. Then I got this one, which is a different one. I'm trying to put them all down in there, but it's not working out. And I got two of the seahorse. So these are the only styles that I found but I was okay with it because they were the ones that I liked the most. So, I mean, $1.25, you guys, there's no way that you can find that cheaper anywhere else. 
All right, let's go into some hair accessories. I got some scunchies here, name brand by Conair. We have this beautiful butterfly. It's like a two-toned kind of blue and pink. Beautiful, I love butterflies. So that was a, a win-win for me. Got this little wavy one. It's also from Scunchy. Pink and it's wavy, claw clip. I need to put these in my hair accessory bag. And then I got this yellow flower. This does not have a brand on it. So I'm assuming, yeah, it's from the Dollar Tree uh, brand Green Briar, excuse me. And it's just a yellow flower, kind of clear yellow. I got some scrunchies, hair scrunchies. You got three with this one for $1.25. So that's a great bargain. I got another one of those tinted lip balms. That's actually for a friend, so. And then I got the floral lip gloss off, also in that Be Pure brand. It's got like the little flower in it. I got another hair clip. These are like the ones that I've been seeing people get off like Timu, Amazon, Shein, places like that, the little flower ones. So for $1.25, I thought, okay, yes, I'll get it and give it a try. Then I got all of the kitchen accessories from the uh, Shore Living. This is a kitchen towel. It's got shells, coral. I always like to update my kitchen towels with whatever their new line that they come out with. I got the drying mats. I got two of them because one's usually not enough for all the dishes I usually wash. So I got two of those. Here's the other one. Well, it got a little smooshed. I got two, but it came as a set. So you get two for one price of these little pot holders, the little squares. Um, and it says sea sand and sunshine on it. And then I got two of the pot holders, like the mitts, the oven mitts. It says sea sand and sunshine on that one too. I got another kitchen towel. This is the one that says sea sand and sunshine like all the other stuff did. And then I got one that just had the shells. And then here is the other oven mitt. And we got some more little decor in here from the Shore Living line. This is considered wall decor. It does have the little rope here, the sand dollar, and then the little like driftwood pieces. So that's really cool, I like that. I don't remember seeing that last year. I think it might be new. I think they've added this this year or I just couldn't find it at my stores. And then we have this kind of shell here. Same thing on the bottom. So I got those to hang up around the house. I have some things from the Shore Living line. As you can see behind me, the little uh, sign back there and some other things. And some of those things did come back. They had some of the same things again like those, um, but I like to update things, you know, here and there instead of having the same stuff. So I'll probably take some of those down and switch them out for some of the newer ones or ones that I like better. Sorry, I'm trying to reach back here to get the stuff because the decor stuff I'm not gonna be putting up right now. All right, so that is all of that. Then on some previous shopping trips, I had picked up some of the, uh, LA Colors Bubble Tea Lip Glosses. Now they're out of the packaging. I took them out. Um, I don't even know if it tells a color or anything, but I got this color. It's kind of an orangey, corally. But I've already opened them because I want to put them in my lip gloss bag. And then I got this one. I think one of them is chocolate. Oh yeah, here it tells. This one's peach. And this one is chocolate latte. So there's that one. And I'm sorry, I do not know why I have the shakes. Usually I get them when I've had coffee, but I'm trying to cut back on my coffee. I'm trying to get back on a, a weight loss and health journey. I got this little, um, I don't even remember, Real Techniques like cleansing pad. Again, these are not in the packaging. I'm sorry, I had opened them so I could put them away. I got another type of uh, like the lip tinted lip balm. It's just white. 
we'll have all kinds of colors going here in a little bit. And you put it on and it's supposed to change colors naturally with your lips. And this one is more of a glittery one. See the sparkle in there? So you'll get like a little bit of a shimmer or glitter with it. I just love putting stuff like that on. I'm not a big makeup wearer. So um, I just like a balm or a gloss. I got me one of these magnifiers because, well, you know, sometimes when I'm doing my YouTube videos for my wax, um, I can't see things. So this lights up. Hopefully I'll be able to see some of the labels a little better. I got this hydrogel and lip mask from Be Pure. It's an aloe vera eye mask and a collagen and watermelon lip mask. So you get two for one there. Let's see, what else do I got stuck over here? I got some of these Be, Be Color Mint Mini Tinted Lip Oils. These are super cute. Great to put in your purse to carry along with you in case you need a little splash of color. I don't think they tell any kind of colors or anything like that. I got this hydrating hand and nail gloves with hyaluronic acid and avocado and niacin cyanamide. Probably didn't say that right. Be pure. And it says it's touchscreen compatible. What? That's weird that you can actually use them on your phone while you got them on your hand because I would have figured they were wet. I just, I don't think I'd want to do that, but there's those and there's sheet masks and hand and feet masks are always really good. I also got the Be Pure Foot Spa Kit in a three pack. Sorry about that glare. You get a foot scrub, a foot mask, and a foot lotion. Then I got the Hydrating Foot Mask. One pair here. And this one also is the same hyaluronic acid, avocado, and the niacinamide. Somebody tell me how to say it. Then I picked up these um, cuticle oils lapis lazuli crystal and they've got like little flower petals in them i believe kind of yeah something inside of there for your cuticles and then this one is green of aventurine aventurine crystal i don't know how to pronounce that but it's cuticle oil so i thought that would be cool to have excuse me while i move some things here that shouldn't be here Got some of these face masks. We have Global Beauty Care Sunflower and Honey Brightening Sheet Mask with Brightening Serum, that word I can't say that starts with an N, and Vitamins A, C, and E. So Sunflower and Honey. And then we have a Carnation and Vanilla Firming Sheet Mask with Firming Serum, Collagen, Vitamins A, C, and E. So I got some of those, like to use those. And am I getting close to the end here? I think I am. I got one more bag, I believe, and I think some of it are repeats, so we're almost finished. I'm sending a friend, a little friend, Mel. Um, she has sent me some beautiful packages of wax and we talk daily and I just love her. And I wanted to gift her something, but I didn't really have any extra wax or anything. So she had only been to Dollar Tree one time, she said. So I picked up some things. I got her this scrunchie. I'm gonna have to tell her she can't watch this video until after she gets her package. I got some gift tissue paper to wrap everything up in to make it look pretty. I got some of this shred to put in the bottom of the box, which I gotta go get a box tomorrow. And then I got two cards. Her birthday is the 11th, which this package probably won't get there until after that, but I'm gonna send her a birthday card and a regular card. I got her this towel scrunchie. I also got myself one in a different color. I love their towel scrunchies. Got one in my hair. Let's see what's not repeat. Okay, there's the carnation of vanilla. I already showed you that. She loves hair scrunchies, so I got her a bunch of those. And some more of the hand and nail gloves. I got her the foot mask as well. She also said she liked lip glosses or lip balms, so I got her this uh, Beauty Intuition. I don't know if there's a color up there. Rosy Nude, I think it says in the lip gloss. Beautiful packaging. Get ready to shine, it says. Okay. And then I got the three pack foot thing for her. Some of the cuticle oil that I've already showed you. I got her one of these beauty uh, shower headbands that you put on like to put your makeup on or wash your face. 
I got several, several of those from Dollar Tree that I love. Got her the little mini tinted lip oils, another scrunchie. Got her the sunflower and honey face mask, as well as that carnation and vanilla one. And then I also got her this violet and bergamot hydrating sheet mask with hydrating serum and the hyaluronic acid and those vitamins. Got her some of these blemish patches. I heard these are really good. I got me some already. So another beautiful scrunchie and another beautiful scrunchie. Very spring and Easter-like. This beautiful pink scrunchie with pearl trim. And this pink and white kind of gingham one. And another cuticle oil. And I think that is it, guys, for this Dollar Tree haul. I hope you enjoyed it. And I hope you will return for my next video. I hope to do some shop with me's at Dollar Tree as well. Um, I haven't gotten into that process quite yet. I haven't figured out if I'm going to be comfortable enough with it or not. But... I hope to do that in the future so I can share with you all what some of my stores have. Um, I try to go about once a week. Sometimes I only get to go once a month, but I love Dollar Tree. You just can't beat their prices and they're really, really getting better and better at what they offer. So I hope you guys are well, taking care of one another, loving one another. Be kind, stay happy and healthy, and I'll talk to you in the next one. Bye.